Hey everyone, I'm Alfred. Welcome back to Mermaid Swamp. Possibly part six, I believe. Yep, still nothing but dots. And more dots. We need more dots. So spooky for no reason. Alright, last time, um... Yeah, I checked the wiki. There's a completely different sequence that happens if, uh... You don't light the fireplace. I'm not sure if I'll do a second playthrough just to not light the fireplace. I might, but who knows. Hmm. So I've got that golf club. Yeah. Huh. Search the swamp more. Oh, just this swamp? Maybe there's something in the swamp. All right. Honey, no. <laughs> Ugh. So gross. A hairpin? Why is it in the swamp? Let go. No, I can't breathe. Such is the nature of being underwater, Rin. Oh, God. Return me. Ugh. <laughs> Oh boy, you idiot. What are you doing? Do you want to die? How'd you know I went diving in? I saw you out the window in the old mansion. I wonder what you were up to and then you jumped in. Have you gone bonkers? You got a plant raptor on your leg and nearly drowned. Stop making me goddamn worry. But it's true. It really is the mermaid's curse. Just now a weird black shadow got my leg. Shut up. Mermaids curse my ass. This crap is ridiculous. Stop talking nonsense and think about how we can deal with the situation. You're the one who needs to get a grip. It's obvious there's nothing normal about this. Not after Yuka's illness and Yuta going crazy. I'll be honest, they're not, there isn't really a good explanation for why that would happen. Ugh. Sidro, what's wrong? Is your head hurting? Yeah, I've had an awful headache since I went walking in the mountains. Maybe I caught a cold or something. Sorry, Sadro. It's because I wandered away. She's lost her Brooklonian uh, accent as well. If you think that, then don't do it again. I'll check more in the old mansion study. If you're feeling okay, you look around too. We can't just be waiting for Suchita to come back, so please. Sun setting. Let's call it a day. I just don't want to sleep. I'm afraid even to dream. Let's explore. I gotta find some lead on getting out of here. Yeah. <laughs> Dumbass. <laughs> Why'd you have to do that? <laughs> Sorry, I couldn't do anything for you, but I'll make it home with Satoru, and I'll get you and Yuka home too. Cool. Oh, I can cut up in the pillow now. Did the old man know that all this bad shit was going to happen and so he just left so he wouldn't have to see it again? Fucking pussy. Just burn the mother down, man. Okay. 
Okay. Okay. Well, let's hit uh, the closet. One over, right? Nope, this is the kitchen. Sure is. I got a golf club. Might be able to move what it's stuck on with that. Of all the things, why a golf club? Ah, there was a rod prop in it. Why do you need that for a closet? A key and a scrap of paper. I found the boiler room key, but I won't tell this to the master. He strictly forbids entry to it. There must be something of value there. I must check inside. A duplicate is made. Key. Uh, what was locked? God dang it. Shit's locked. Ooh, getting a little bit of the heebie-jeebies here. A spring look. Anyway, if you're very, very curious about what happens if you don't light the fire, um, please download this game yourself. It's free. Specifically speaking, this version is free. Um, I don't know about the original, but this is credited as the remake of Mermaid Swamp. Just Google Mermaid Swamp if you would like to download it. It's not too hard to find. That's what I did. Take this. I'll pin ya. I'll pin ya, you fishy bastard. Gosh. I hope I don't have to remember that for any reason. Hmm. Maybe it's not here that the, um, oh. Of course. Doy. Uh -huh. A lot of pipes. Does a regular old house need a boiler room like this? It wouldn't. Unless you had a bunch of giant secret tanks holding women. There's something on the desk. A car key? Or maybe it's for the boat. Nice. I feel good about having that. It means that I can't be bottle of f fluid. Unidentifiable machines. All manner. This thing says voltage and power. A power generator? What's it doing in a boiler? Huh. Part of the stone fence has fallen over. Hey, maybe we could use this. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay. Let's... I don't know what I want to do first. I, I'm, I'm going to do this because I've, I've known about it for longer. I guess I have to get the rope first. That makes sense. I'm waiting for the next jump scare. We've had a uh, we've had a blobby ghost recently, so the next one's probably going to be another eyeball. Then again, we had an eyeball around here somewhere, so it's. Wonder if I can pick a lock with that. That'd be kind of cool. Golf bag. Man, catch me just nine ironing everything in a situation like this. 
think it was on this side upstairs. Yeah, here we go. I feel something hard in the pillow. Got that kitchen knife. I could cut it open for that juicy treat inside. <laughs> she's, the fact that she's like, ooh, a juicy treat. Mm. So coming up now, I, I'm getting the sense that there will be a scare of some variety. And then I'll poop my pants and scream. One of these is still locked. Is it this one? Oh yeah, and there was someone that they called stepmom, but I I don't know who is saying that. Maybe the guy remarried. I think I'm done in here. Here's hoping at least. Ronky. Unsure where it's used. Great. A red common. A violet. Tsukisage. Pink common. A yellow kosode. And a blue furisode. I want to open it. It doesn't seem like it's locked. Oh, brother. Oh, crap. Okay. Red, purple, pink, yellow, blue. Red, purple, pink, yellow, and 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 blue. Really bad to be lost while I'm trying to remember something. Because I'm trying to remember and remember. I'm trying to remember the thing and remember where it is. Speaking of which, uh, red, purple, pink, yellow, and blue. It wasn't in here, was it? Oh, God, where was that fucking book? <laughs> red, purple, pink, yellow, and blue. Purple, pink, yellow, and blue, starting with red. Red, purple, pink, yellow, and blue. Here we go, you bastard. Plum. Okay. Oh, good. That, that'll help a lot. Red, purple, pink, yellow, and blue. I guess I probably don't have to remember it that hard. So, um, I'm still sick from recording a thing I recorded a couple of days ago. Red, purple, pink, yellow, blue. And so I was like, man, why do I keep recording stuff if I'm sick? Okay. Pink. Blue. Red. So pomegranate. Wisteria. Pomegranate, wisteria. Pink, yellow, blue. Pomegranate, wisteria. Plum. Pomegranate, wisteria, plum. Plum. Gardenia, spiderwort. Okay. Pomegranate. Wisteria. Is this plum? Round with some leaves. Draping. Round with some leaves, draping. Round with some leaves, dangling. Branch with flowers. A single flower and then some 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 stems. Yeah, dangling. F 
flowering branch, single flower, some stems. Nice. It's open. Nothing good inside, though. Sacks and cotton gloves. Nothing that seems useful. A rope. Nice. So now we're really overdue for a scare. But on the other hand, it could be that we know that we're getting to the next thing. And so there will be a scare as soon as we complete this. Oops. Let's see. I think I got what I need to go down. Steak. And there we go. Oh, cool. I did it all. Another miscellaneous liquid bottle. A sack. A rope. Weird crack. Shelves with nothing on it. Empty bottles. Something on the table. Goop. This is a map? But it's only got the area around the swamp. There's a red mark, but what does it mean? Swamp map. What? Something's there? Oh, hell no. Nah. I gotta get out of here and quick. The lantern. Oh, dear. Get the golf club, Ren. Damn it. My headache's not getting any better. I can't get any good rest like this. Is Ren actually resting? I bet she's all fucking around. It's cool that you switch characters. Told her rest. Damn it. Gotta go look for her. Ugh. My head. It's gonna split open. I'm gonna give birth to my own brain. Shut up. Stop it. Stop. Uh-oh. Looks like it's all up to me. His grandma comes and saves him. Yeah. What happened? Broke after being dropped. Well, I was right about the spooks. God damn it. I was literally like, someone's going to get that fucking axe. It's bright, which means I slept till morning. What the effing? That wasn't a dream, was it? So mad. I was literally like, someone's going to get the axe. Ah, Satoro. Where'd you go? Uh, I found some secret room. I was looking around there. Any developments with you? No. Nothing. I found some kind of map, but I don't understand it. I can't even tell the orientation. Could you take a look, maybe? Satoro, what's up? Satoro? What are you doing? Let go of me, hey. What's the matter? You're shaking. I'm scared. Huh? Of what I'll do to you. He pulls out the axe. Ah! And he was like, blog, and he stabbed me. With two of our friends getting messed up, I think you mean killed, and not being able to go anywhere, I don't know what to do anymore. I'm just glad you're safe. Sadero. You palooka. Please stay by my side today. I hate being alone. I don't want to be away from you. I think you're going to go axe crazy, man. I'm going to be honest. Yeah, as if. Who do I you, dickless? You lost your mind, man. You're acting real weird. What's with the crap you're spouting? Don't tell me you're turning like Yuta was. Come here. No, don't come near me. 
Such an ignorant girl. Yep. There's the axe. Told you to come here. You won't talk back to me, woman. Oh, God. He was possessed by a man from the 1950s. Stay back. <laughs> I like that they're like, hey. Fucking save, though. Go. Run. Crap. <laughs> fucking. The stairs, man. I warned you about those stairs. I told you, dog. More coffee. Okay. Go. <laughs> I've juked you, you fool. You can run, but you can't hide. Dodge. <laughs> okay, cool. Sarah, did you vanish? Sweetie, there's a hole in the floor. No, the floor gave way. So we fell into the room below. Well, great. Now we don't know where he is. I wonder what happens if you don't dodge. Like, why would you select don't dodge in a situation like this? Sero, you fell into your axe. Damn, that hurts. <laughs> Just like, there's an axe sticking out of your chest. You're like, damn! Ouch! I need a Tylenol. Maybe two Tylenols. It's okay, I'll stop the blood. Stop it, blood. I don't have anything that can... Oh, what should I do? What should I do? Can I find something? Uh, and take out the axe. I take it out. Want a ton of blood spread out? Yeah. I told you, just take it out. Ugh. Sandro, get up. You're okay. I'll try to stop it. Who's playing the piano? Like, I only mentioned because this is one of the only parts of the game with music. And there's a piano in the room. Sandro, don't try to stand. Lie down. Don't touch me. Going out in such a miserable way. You gotta be shitting me. All right, well, I guess it'll be pretty easy to follow the axe, a dusty piano. It'll, it'll be pretty easy to figure out where he went based on the, uh, yeah, there you go. Mm hmm Damn. Sandra, what are you doing? An axe in the gut. No, I can't have that be. Sedaro. Away! I have to find a map. Get out of here. Even an idiot like you can do it. Figure out the landscape. Make it home, alright? Don't be ridiculous. Come over here. I'll help you. You'd panic over a speck of blood. As if I'd want your medical expertise. Forget about me. A lot of tsundere is here. No, I can't do this alone. Please let me help, Sedaro. I swear it'll be okay. Ren, for once in your life, listen. <laughs> no, 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 don't go, don't leave me alone. Such a stupid girl. I want you to live, just live. Sadero, wait. Oh God. That's so getting infected. Dive, Rin. Dive like it's free. Endless summer. This is a character in free that's also named Rin. That's why I was thinking about it. Sadaro. The old man comes back. He's like, hey guys, what's... Oh my god! I hope the old man doesn't come back because I've forgotten his voice. Gotta do something. Have to get out of here soon. 
the wristwatch data reward. Hmm. <laughs> the red mark if this is north then the rest the, the red thing is east well if i go right from the new mansion i don't know which way the mansion's facing how can i figure that out maybe if i go to the study i'll find something so one thing that um i feel as though tension has been lost a little bit because there are no monsters like i know that there are the weird gross like swollen mermaid ladies but currently I don't know of any they're also all like bloated and probably hard to like it's hard for them to chase you uh, was this the study it meant Man, you got to wonder what kind of favoritism it shows. Don't get lost, Alfie. Find the place. Okay. <sighs> I had to make sure he was still there. I got a little worried. Anywho. So maybe it's this study? Can't believe how far in advance I called the axe. Like, I mean, I guess it's like a literal Chekhov's gun, right? Like, in the quote from Anton Chekhov about the gun, you say, if there is a gun... he's Anton Chekhov, Russian playwright, says, if there is a fucking gun on the wall in Act 1... Make goddamn sure somebody fires an act two. And like, here we are. We've seen this axe for hours now, and we're here. Ah! <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Why haven't I turned that fucking alarm off? God damn it. <laughs> that was... <laughs> that was the most honestly I've ever gotten scared on my fucking show. Holy shit. I've, I've never gotten that legitimately scared by anything. I, I jumped and yelled. What the hell? At 4 p.m., there's an alarm on my phone that goes off and it plays My Chemical Romance because of course it does. Look at me. Um, <laughs> to make sure that I'm awake uh, and initially I think it was so I would be awake in time for my friend getting off of work because she gets off at around 5. Um, holy shit. Cause, cause like it's it's kind of the thing, right? You get scared. You're playing a spooky video game, and you get scared because of the video game. But like, you don't like scream. I don't I don't scream when I'm scared of video games. But then something scary and surprising happened in the real world, and that's why I got scared. <laughs> God damn it! How to read maps? Found it. Hold a clock level in your left hand and turn the hour hand to the sun. South is towards the point between the 12 and the hour hand. Oh, cool. So here, presumably. This is the sun. Our hands here. Totally, yeah. Old mansion is to the south, which means the mark on the map is to the east. 
Something across the swamp? No doubt I get lost in the forest if I try to go around. Is there anything else I could do? I know something. Boat time. Use this across the swamp. Another big Chekhov's gun right there. My wife always calls them flashing arrows as though there's literally an arrow flashing on the screen pointing at something. Oh, the key. Yeah. That's not at all what it is. Oh, it's been 30 minutes as well. Um, all right. I'm going to cut this here. Next time we'll hit the boat and maybe do some other things. Uh, I've been Alfred. This has been an extra spooky episode of Mermaid Swamp. Uh, happy Halloween, everyone, and have a great day. Thank you for coming. Yep, still broken. All right, have a good day.